Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. It's Viper26 Orb right here, and welcome back to Lower Nightmares 2. In this video, we are going to get the secret ending. As you, as you can see, we only need two glitch remains in Chapter 1, which I know where they are. Um, two more in Chapter 2, one more in Chapter 3, and one more in Chapter 4. Now, one and four aren't that bad to do, but two and three... <laughs> and then we have to do all of chapter 5 again. But we are going to start from chapter 1. Now I have a video up, a guide, by Somewhat Awesome Gaming. Or Somewhat Awesome Games, I mean. You can go check them out if you want. Okay, we have the door again. Which I'm just like, what the frick? <laughs> what happened uh, in the last video? We're all here. Wait, was. Um, trophy earned. How do I look? Um, okay, I just want to go to Paul's look at uh, see how many hats we've had unlocked, and then well, boom, apparently, you get that one after you beat the game. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping this is the way that it is, like, once I get these two glitch remains, I can quit the game, go to the next chapter, and then boom, I'm done, because if I have to replay each chapter all over again, I'm going to be very, well, very terrified. Still going this way. I think there's a trophy. I'm not 100% sure. That's like the first game to where you have to beat it in a certain amount of time with and without dying. So. I mean, that could be a possibility, I think. Wait, is it here? Wait, is it is it this part here? No, it's not. Okay, now here the log comes down. We just gotta run. Now, the two things that we see, we get before we end up meeting six. Not any of those. Or not here yet, so... What the... Okay, then. Now, I'm just trying to figure out everything before I look up a guide. Not a guide. Before I look up an ending explain, I'm trying to figure out everything. Of what the freak... Okay, here it is. Of what the freak is going on in this game. Go this way. 
and wha um, what the f Whose grave is this? Probably that child's or probably someone else's. I did hear a theory about this all being like Mono's nightmare. I'm just like, it, it's a good theory. I'm not gonna lie, it is a good theory. But I just really don't agree with it. The reason why is that, okay, games being like horror games being like dreams or nightmares. Like, I don't know, it has to be done like a. Like a certain. What? I, I'm not certain. What, I, I don't know. Like, Little Hope, it was all an hallucination. Sure, would I would I liked it better if it was all real? Yes, I would. But... Little Nightmares, they said they wanted to be, like... Like a mysterious world, and... And not all our answers would be, like... Or not all our questions would be answered, and it's just like... Making it all a dream would just, like, make none of that matter. Trophy on wild kids. Okay, so I'm, I can exit the menu. And then we are in chapter... 2, right? Okay. Yeah, we have all four of those. I could see ways of like co-op working in this game or like playing a six like it would wouldn't be canon though oh oh now glitch one if I'm correct in the, looking at this video I already know where glitch one is and I've or I'm not Oh, well, I mean, yeah, but I've already gotten it. Yeah, I, I think I've already, yeah, I've already gotten Glitch 1 in Chapter 2. Well, I'll see you when we get to the next Glitch. Alright guys, so we, okay, um, we didn't find the secret yet, the last one we need, but apparently this, right? No, I thought this was a normal, like, you know, one of those normal dolls when we first played, right? Turns out this is an actual child, and where their head is tied to the freaking chest piece with the crown. Yeah, that's fricked up. It's, uh, that, that even makes this even more disturbing. But, yeah. Anyways, guys, um, uh, like I said, I will see you back when I find the next glitch. Okay, guys, um, I found out something pretty cool. Okay, well, I died. Um, I basically found out that, you know, remember when we were playing and, um, Six went to go kill the doll, right? Well, I found out you can kill it before Six does. Boom. Right there. And for some reason, its head still slams onto the ground. But yeah, as long as you're quick enough, um, you can actually kill the doll before Six can. But if it's your first playthrough. I mean, you're probably watching this. I mean, you could be watching this if you haven't already played the game or seen someone play it, but if you're watching this after your first playthrough, then, well, you now know this. It still has the animation go on, though. Um, six, are you alright? 
But yeah, um, anyways, uh, let's continue. Hey guys, okay, so, um, I played through all the chapter 2, thinking it was at the end, but then, oh, because oh, I'm looking at this guide, I'm like, wait, the final one's at the boat, wasn't I there? It's all the way in the beginning of chapter, uh, 2. So, yeah. Trophy room, school kids. Anyways, we are now going to chapter 3. And if you saw my playthrough of it, you know that chapter 3 is a big no-no. But we're going to have to do it anyway. Because I don't want to do chapter 3. But yeah, guys, anyways, I will see you all in the next one. Okay, guys, on the guide, I saw the last, not the last, or the only uh, glitch I need for chapter 3, and boom, this is it. Yes, trophy earning sick kids. Holy frick. I was not expecting that. But yeah, we are now done with this chapter. I don't want to do this chapter. I was basically having a panic attack. Um, yeah, um, screw mannequins. We are now going to the last chapter that we have to get a um, glitch on. Chapter 4. Now, this isn't as bad as chapter 2 or 3, so I think we're fine. Um, he's, nope, 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 where is chapter four? Yep, chapter four. And I will see you all when we get to the next glitch. Guys, it's the beginning of the chapter, and, well, we already have... We already have the one glitch that we need, so we're... After this, we're gonna head all the way over to chapter five. And, well, I'll see you when we get to that ending. And, okay, never mind, um, we, I mean, after we get the glitch, of course, if I stop dying. Here it is, okay, the last glitch that we need. Okay, trophy or no more remains. Trophy are in Pale Kids. I uh, get it, because we're in Pale City. So yeah, we're going to head over to Chapter 5. The final chapter of the game. And I will get to you guys after we, well... Um... Defeat 6. Hey everyone, um... Here, um, here at the at the at the end of the game. Six, don't let us go, please. Six, why do you let us go? And guys, I know some of the theories, but I don't know the secret ending. I avoided anything. One of my friends told me about different theories because he said if I look at any theory videos I'm end up I'm gonna end up seeing the secret ending um one of my friends is in the party on PlayStation but you can't hear him but that's not the same friend it's he just my one friend just said it's at the end of the game at the end like at the end of the game at the end part like at the end I, I don't know when exactly, probably after this part to where we see Mono become the Thin Man. But he said, um, will I, will I still have to look something, or I said, will I still have to look something up after I see the secret ending? And he'll be like, no, you can basically guess what the, um, other theories are building off of for the, um, the ending. End of the hall. Okay. 
Now I found out because one time there was an article with the developers and they said it's a sequel to the first game chronologically. So it takes place after Very Little Nightmares but takes place before Little Nightmares 1. And then we have Mono right here. But dude, what the frick? Like, okay, guys, here's my theory. Okay, well, it could. Um, if they are to bring Mono back for another game. So, I don't know if you guys watch any movies or shows that have like time travel or time loop, but usually sometimes what happens is the character, like a version of themselves, sees everything and it just shoots right through them at one point and, my, and then boom, they, they seen every time. So maybe as like a DLC or maybe as uh, something they could show how Mono is back if they make a third game is that Mono like it could get to the point to where one of the versions of Mono fighting the Thin Man like as he's fighting him he could see visions of what was going on and once he finally beats him everything just shoots right through him and he's like oh crap Six is gonna betray me the Thin Man is actually me what the freak is going on and yeah um but i think it's insane that he becomes a thin man like i really wasn't expecting that surprised the crap out of me like but like theories that like I, like six like was evil from the beginning at like how she like broke the doll's head or just like um what's it called um popping the fingers of an mannequin arm or prosthetic arm for the mannequins um and warming herself while the doctor in the by the furnace while the doctor is burning alive and another theory is that um remember the hanging man in the beginning of the first game yeah that's mono how would he get there i i still don't know <laughs> um but we should see the secret ending right here by the way sorry if you guys hear some background noise i'm recording like some of these clips i'm like the first collectible of ch okay so this video re recorded from chapter one to a little bit of two up until i reached a chessboard was the other day <gasps> whoa 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 what the freak what the freak Thin man? Mono? <gasps> okay, this is after like six left Mono to fall. Okay. Okay, so and cause saw the TV there. She went through the TV. <gasps> what the fudge? Shadow six, what the freak? What up? <gasps> what? That's a picture of the mall. What the fudge? I know that part's sad. Bro, what the fudge? What the fudge? Okay, well... Okay, hold on. Holy crap, okay, so many theories and crap is going through my head at the moment. Okay, so, basically, um, what happened is that, uh, or my theory, it, or, like, Mono sees all the memories and he somehow gets out of there safe, like, maybe he speeds, and like, <laughs> speeds it up a bit, or, like, tries to, like, do something, like, accidentally trip six and, like, they have to help each other up, or something, they both get there, I don't know. Right? And, uh... What's it called? Um... 
So, we saw the picture of the mall. And, okay. If, since this is a prequel of the first game, right? Maybe Six's hunger wasn't act wasn't active. Like, maybe the hunger in Shadow Six is their power. Like, the Shadow Six is a different entity. <clears throat> oh my god, what the frick. Um... And that, um... What the fudge? What the fudge? Hold up. Wait, what? Oh, in the first game? Oh, okay, okay, so guys, that's a, a theory my friend told me, is that Six is actually the lady in the first game. But, okay... Maybe, like, Six is hung- like, the Shadow Six is a different entity, like the Thin Man or the North Wind, and maybe her hunger was active after it, and... Okay, a couple theories I saw that maybe, like, like, Six doesn't want to eat Mono, that's why she let him go, or Six found- or realized or found out that he's the Thin Man, which, then why not pick him up? Like, why you could have prevented him becoming the Thin Man? And the things that how, like, Six is evil, and she will only help those who are useful to her. Mono proved useful to her the entire game, and she lets him go. What the fudge? But, um, apparently, like, there's, like, a huge, like, oh my god, I don't freaking know. Maybe, okay, was the Thin Man trying to, like, save Mono, or, like, possess him like the North Wind was probably going to do? Um... Did Six's, like, shadowy version possess her? Me Is the shadow, uh, like, her hunger? Or, like, is she, like, like, does she, like, like, is this supposed to represent what she did to Mono? And then maybe, like, that Shadow Six, go like, goes out of her and she's like, what the freak? What did I do to Mono? And I don't know. And that's probably, like, supposed to be all the guilt and, and hunger or whatever. But that picture of the the mall was there, so I'm guessing she goes to the mono, or not the mono. She goes to the mall, and seeing and knowing the comics, how she got caught by the uh, the fairy man. Maybe she got caught on purpose to go there and eat people. Which holy freaking crap! Um, Six's power probably has to be, well, the worst out of all of them, because, well, she could probably absorb powers from eating, but she gets really hungry. I'm pretty sure if she doesn't eat sooner or later, she's going to die, so... Or she could turn into a monster, or both, but... <laughs> what the heck? Six's power probably has to be, like, the worst one out of... Like, none of their powers are good, sure, it's pretty neat. Oh, or, uh, Mono can travel through TVs and stuff. Um, but then there comes the risk of the Thin Man. Six, she can probably absorb powers meeting people. Bad side, she eats. Another bad side is that she gets very hungry. Now, okay. What the fudge? There... Ugh. Okay, so there are theories that Six is the lady, which I could possibly see. I mean, maybe... I don't know. I mean, I mean, the Thin Man, we can already tell how Mono is the Thin Man, but it really doesn't make sense on how, like, or, like, how could it make sense, or what is the entire theory of Six being the lady? I don't know, but it, it's a little nightmares. The world is supposed to be mysterious, and it's up to our theories, because not all of our questions are going to be answered. But, like... Uh, okay, apparently, okay, the evil part, the e the true evil of this story is whatever the heck this thing is that is around, that, like, that mono is in, the huge eye thing, the, the, you know what I mean. Like, I, I forget what it's called, but apparently, because apparently, like, I, I, did it have a name? I don't know. I, I if it did, I, I forgot it, but... That thing is a true evil and the reason why everything is going on here. But, um, are we going to have a little Nightmares 3? If so, will Mono return? Are we going to be playing as Mono in some way? Like, maybe how, like, my theory of how they could bring Mono back could work. Maybe, like, we are going to be playing as 6 again. 
And or we could have a new character. Oh my god, dude. But anyways, guys, holy freaking crap. This game was freaking amazing. And this is like the second time going through the ending. Um, but holy crap as, crap, as you can see, I didn't get all the hats, but... Dude, holy frick. Uh, in my opinion, I like this one better than the first one. I, I do still like the first one, I'm just saying I like this one better. It is, of course, harder. I think it's scarier than the first one. Um... Okay, the like, I'd say the scariest parts of this game, like... The most terrifying part of this game, like... Or, the t most terrifying chapter in this game, I'd have to say, is chapter 3. And the most shocking chapter is definitely, well, chapter 5. And the most confusing. But it's just like, what the freak? <laughs> what the freak? What the freak? What the freak? I don't know. But, is I'm trying to think. I don't know. I... Uh... I don't know, I might make a separate video on this, but anyways guys, hopefully you all enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, don't forget to turn on those, no turn on those notifications, join the OK Squad, Vibe Squad, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.